think of Jim Carrey. He was just struggling as a, a comedian. But he loved what he was doing. You can't just want it. Wanting is very important because it'll cause you to do some things. If you really want it enough, it'll cause you to do some things that are in harmony with being the person. I didn't love everything about having four kids and two cats and living in a small travel, 28 foot travel trailer for 15 months. I didn't love about the lines of the six of us to use this one little bathroom. I didn't love all kinds of things, but I loved what it was, where it was taking us. And so I learned to hold my attitude in harmony with this is an important step. Uh, so Jim Carrey wrote a check to himself in the absence of having anybody, any answers for how it could occur. Uh, they were not inviting him to the comedy clubs in Los Angeles. He wrote a check for $10 million and he would go up on Mulholland Drive and he had a vision of certain producers and directors calling him for work. And he would move into those imaginal conversations until he could feel them as real. If you write nothing down tonight, write that down. Feel it as real. Feeling is part of the secret of moving the energy into the form. He could feel it as real. And he said he wouldn't leave Mulholland Drive, come back down into Hollywood area until he could feel it as real. And he would say, you know, this really does belong to me. It just hasn't quite happened yet, but it really belongs to me. This is happening and it's coming into form. His, the check he wrote himself was for $10 million. No actor had ever, male, female, no actor had ever been paid $10 million for uh, a movie up until then. And I think it was three or four years later, uh, he told Oprah, he actually was signing the contract for $10 million to star in Dumb <laughs> and Dumber. Now, was it dumb for him to go up there? <laughs> No, he was putting himself more and more in harmony when it looked out here like nothing was happening. People say to me, how long does it take? You know, how come it happens so fast for her and it's taking too long for me? Well, it has to do with our ability to be in harmony with our outcome and hold that state. So we're learning, it, it, we're learning. It took me, I had five years where I was speaking mostly to an empty room in the house because we were on a farm and nobody was, and once in a while somebody come and listen and maybe on Easter, the whole family might come. But I was passionate about the dream. I kept doing it anyway. I mean, the work I have in the world today would not have happened if I hadn't done the thing that and be passionate about that light that comes on in anybody's eyes who's interested in this. What can happen for them? So Jim Carrey. $10 million, first actor in the world to ever have that. Didn't, that did not happen to Jim Carrey. That happened with Jim Carrey.